We don't have time today to go through all the Medicaid asset <coughs> preservation strategies. All I want you to know is that there are strategies that do exist. Medicaid is an impoverishment program for single people. You can only have $2,000 in your house or car. For a couple, you can have more money than that, basically between 60 and 135,000. But I want you to know, and I'll go through an example a little bit later, that there is the ability to qualify for Medicaid benefits with far more assets than what I just stated. How do you do that? You know what Medicaid's rules are. You work with a Medicaid planning attorney. But as a Medicaid planning attorney, I can't do any of these Medicaid strategies if I have an inadequate durable power of attorney. So one of the things that an elder law attorney will do that an estate planning lawyer won't do is we will put provisions in our durable powers of attorney that allow the type of transactions that need to be done to qualify for Medicaid. So when you go to an estate planning lawyer, of course I recommend that you go to a lawyer and not do online. But, yes? No, that's a great question. Gifting does not include tithing. Tithing is a regular event, and so when Medicaid looks at it, they see that. Now, if you're trying to make up for tithing you haven't done for the last five years, that's a problem. <laughs>